Tuesday. Now, the Thursday class is a Tai Chi class, which will now be a Tuesday Tai Chi. And then on Thursday, this stretch strength and balance class is going to be labeled a little bit differently, bone strengthening. And then, um, so it will kind of match up with the class that we have in Oregon. So you'll have two opportunities uh, to do the uh, a, a stretch strength and balance type of class, which is bone strengthening. Now, I like to think of even my Tai Chi class as a bone strengthening because it's really good for you. All the work that we do is very similar. It's just different type of movements that we focus on. So we have more gyrations of the body or the rotation of the joints, which is super, super good for the body, the uh, rotation of the joints. Now you can do this class standing or sitting and make it work for you. Ideally you can stand, but if you can't, you can sit and just kind of modify things along as we go. We're gonna do some, uh, uh, warm-ups and then we're going to add some uh, opportunity to do weights in the class if you want it's it's an optional weights are not um, re uh, required to use so let's start with uh, three heart opening breaths so we bring, bring our feet together now when we stretch i want you to stretch through your thighs and and through your buttocks so we want to kind of start into a squat put the palms in front of the abdomen so when you inhale slowly come up so you feel it in your buttocks as you're rising straightening the knees and then when you stretch, you want to stretch through the thighs and then exhale, come on down again. Let's do that again. So through the nose, we're in a little bit bend here. So we straighten the knees up slowly as we come up, feel it in your glutes and just stretch through the abdomen. Yeah, and then exhale, come on down. Okay, let's do one more time and then we lend into forward bend. So it's inhale and stretch. Now when we exhale, let's hinge into hip. And just drop the arms down and let the weight of the arms pulling on the back of the legs. Stretching the back of the legs, I think, is a really important thing. It just it improves your circulation. Uh, it makes exercising so much safer. Now let's add the breath, three of them. So through the nose, let's inhale. Now when you exhale, keep the back straight as you just open more of that stretch in the back of the legs. Again, inhale, big long inhale. The body's expanding with that breath. When you exhale, just relax more deeply into the stretch for the back of your legs. One more time, inhaling and exhaling. Now, when you inhale, slowly come on up and always inhale by it through the nose, by the way, and exhale, relax. The reason we inhale through the nose, there's little hairs in the nose that filter out the impurities. Now, let's go back to where we were starting to start uh, at the beginning, where we just throw arms around from side to side. When you get to a side, push down into a hip. When you push down into a hip, you're opening up the tissue in the hip area. Again, another great way to do all these exercises to open up these tissues as you're going up and down and bending and twisting and stuff like that. This is a, a great way to relax those areas so we don't pull or tear anything. It's a nice, safe way to exercise, in my opinion. Now, let's do the same motion, but I want you to bring your arms up a little bit higher, uh, but, just, but around your waist. I want you to tap either side with the with your palm and let the back of the palm tap your back as you're doing this. So we stimulate our internal organs as we do this. And it's a couple more things to do with our mind. So the back of the palm taps your kidney. Some of the top palm is either tapping your stomach or liver, depending on which side you go on. Your liver will be on your right side, the stomach is on the left. Now let's bring the arms up to shoulder height. So the inside palm goes face down, the outside palm goes face up, and we're still pushing down into a hip. So a little bend of the knees when you get to a side, so you're deliberately pressing down into the hip area. And it's a nice stretch. <laughs> I like this so much. That's a great way to warm up. I don't like it until I start doing it. When I start doing it, I love it. Now widen the step a little bit and reach up high <laughs> and go to the other side and stretch. Again, lift up high and stretch. Other side, give it a good stretch. One more time, stretch. Other side and stretch. Now come to the center. Let's warm up the body to a little vibration. And we're just bouncing the knees, let the shoulders relax. See how relaxed you can get the shoulders. So deliberately relax the shoulders while you're bouncing the knees. And see how cool that feels. Doesn't that feel good? Okay, now let's add a little shake into the palms as we're bouncing the knees. 
and just give them a really fast shake. Of it. You get the reward when we stop because you'll feel a tingling in your hands with this really, really marvelous, really nice. Now let's add a little wiggle of the hips while we're bouncing the knees, shaking the palms, and then shimming the shoulders. And then while we're shimming the shoulders, just bobble the head, and just relax the whole body. Let everything loosen up as you're doing all this motion. And whatever you're doing is perfect. Yeah, nothing has to be exactly any one way or another. Just kind of let yourself get all shook up. Now stop, feel the tingling in your fingers, bring your mind to the body here. And this is a mind-body class designed to bring your mind into the body. You get great benefit. We do a lot of breath work. So everything we do is with the breath. And that entirely oxygenates the bloodstream, which impacts all the cells throughout your body. Okay, <laughs> now let's bring our, bend our arms up like this and Bring our palms in, fingers are pointing towards each other, and come into a squat. We're going to straighten the legs and pull the elbows back. So we begin with an inhale and exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, that's two. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, three more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, last two. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, one more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, no more. And inhale, straighten the knees, exhale, lower the arms, just kind of shake them up in the shoulders, kick the legs up, keep loosening the body. Now, let's clap the hands over our head, so let's bend the knees, put the palms in front of the abdomen. So when you inhale, straighten the knees and lift up and clap, and then exhale, bend the knees as you come down. Again, inhale, up, and exhale, down. Inhale, up. And exhale, three going to 10. Inhale, up, exhale down. Inhale, up, and exhale, five more. Inhale, up, and exhale, six. Inhale, up, and exhale, three more. Exhale, and inhale, exhale, one more. And come down. And now, just straighten the knees and relax and shake the arms and kick the legs out. Bring those shoulders forward and curve the back just a little bit and bend the knees. All right, now we're going to bring the shoulders up and around three times and then we'll reverse and go the other way. So, bend the knees are bent. So when you inhale, straighten the knees, bring the shoulders up to the ears, open the chest, when you exhale, float them down and squat. Then bring those shoulders forward to curve and stretch the back. Then inhale up, straighten the knees, and then exhale, bend the knees as you Come down, stretch, lots of good stretch for the back. Bring them forward and inhale up, open the chest. When you exhale, come on down. Now from here, we're going to reverse. So bring those shoulders back and up as you inhale, straighten the knees and exhale, bend the knees as you come down. Two more times around, throw up through the nose. Let's inhale and exhale. Again, inhale up and exhale. Okay, straighten the knees, kick the legs out a little bit, bring our arms out to the side. All we're going to do is our cross our arms and bring them back, and let's come into a squat. So when you inhale, we'll straighten the knees and cross, and exhale, bend the knees, and other way, and cross. So right hand's on top, now the left hand's on top. Right hand's on top, now the left hand's on top. So exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, five more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, six. Exhale, inhale, exhale, three more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, two more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, one more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, no more. Then inhale, straighten the knees, exhale, lower the arms. I take a moment, shake the arms out, shim the shoulders, bobble the head a little bit, kick the legs out, just loosen up. Now we do the same motion, but we're gonna do a double cross. So we're just gonna to come to the front, cross, come out a little bit, cross again, and then open. And then we'll, the, the right hand was on top, now the left hand will be on top. So that's left hand, open. Okay, that's one. Right, open, left. That's two, right, Open, left, that's three. Right, open, left, that's four. Right, open, 
left five more, all right? Open, left, open, right, open, left, three more, right? Open, left, open, two more, right? Open, left, one more, right? Open, left, no more. And inhale and exhale, relax those arms. Now you kind of got to shake it out. The arms are starting to get a little bit tired, so you kind of relax everything, kind of loosen it up, let the blood flow back to where it's got to go. And now, put your uh, left hand on the hip. So we'll reach up at the right, then come down, switch hands, and reach up at the left. So it's inhale and exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, that's two. Exhale, stretch, then inhale, bend the knees. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, bend the knees. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, that's four. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, five more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, six. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, three more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, we're down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, two more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, one more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, no more. Then inhale, straighten the knees, and then exhale, relax the arms. Now shake those arms out. Shimmy the shoulders, bobble the head, kick the legs out, just loosen the body. All right, now, <laughs> with our arms extended, we're going to pull the shoulders back. We're going to bring the palms together and twist to the right, open up, bring the palms together, and twist to the left. Twist, open, twist, right. I got this wrong. So bring the arms out. So bring them together, twist to the right. Come back, open, come back, twist to the left. Come back, open, come back, twist to the right. Come back, open, come back, left, come back, open, come back, to the right. Come back, open, come back to the left. Come back, open, come back to the right. Three more. Come back, open, come back to the left. Come back, open, come back to the right. Come back, open, come back. One more. Come back, open, come back to the right. Come back, open, come back to the left and come back and no more. <laughs> I think I got a little mixed up there, but anyway, <laughs> we got the hang of it and we did pretty good, okay? Let's take a quick moment to have a little sip of water. So, just enjoy. Let the lid flow, then come back. Now, bring the palms up, face up. We'll do a military press overhead. Come into a squat. So let's begin with an inhale and exhale, stretch and inhale, come down. Can you feel the abdomen when you stretch and inhale, come down. Exhale, three and inhale, that's down. Exhale, four and inhale. Exhale, five more and inhale. Exhale, six and inhale. Exhale, three more and inhale. Exhale, stretch and inhale, one more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, no more. Then inhale, straighten the knees, exhale, lower the arms. Take the arms out, shoot the shoulders, bobble the head, and kick the legs out. Let's do a little side bend. Feet are hip width apart. Bring your right arm down to the knee, palm down to the knee, and then come up. Now the left side, come down. Let's add the breath. So it's inhale, and exhale down, and inhale. Exhale down, and inhale for two. Exhale down and inhale. Exhale down and inhale for three. Going to eight. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale four more. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale three more. 
exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale. One more, two more. Exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale. One more. Exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale. No more. Let's relax. Shake the arms, kick the legs out. Now let's do a, a bicep curl with the front step. And all we're going to do is step out the right, curl the arms, and then do the left. So right foot out and let's inhale and exhale and inhale, other side. Exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale, exhale. That's two. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and three. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and four. Exhale and inhale, exhale, and five more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and six. Exhale, inhale, exhale, three more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and two more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, one more. Exhale, and inhale, exhale, and inhale, no more. Okay, let's bring the arms up. We're gonna bring our right knee up and pull our arms down with the right knee comes up and then we'll do the left side. So let's inhale and exhale. Inhale, left side, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and two. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and three. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and four. Inhale, exhale, inhale, five more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and six. Inhale, exhale, inhale, three more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, last two. Inhale, exhale, inhale, one more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, no more. And inhale up and exhale, relax and shake the arms, shoot the shoulders and bobble the head. Now, let's do a step back and swing both arms behind us. Let's bring our right leg back first. So we begin right here. So inhale and exhale. Let's bring the arms the other way. To the left side. So inhale and exhale. There we are. Right side. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and four. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and five more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and six. Exhale, inhale, exhale, three more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, two more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, one more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, no more. Then inhale and exhale, relax the body, kick the legs out. And let's just take a little break and do three heart opening breaths, palms for the abdomen. So when we inhale, just stretch out through the thighs and exhale, two more, come down a little bit of a squat. When you come up, feel the stretch of your buttocks as you inhale and exhale, come on down one more time. Inhale, now when we exhale, let's just hang the forward bend and just hinge at the hips, let the arms drop, and feel the stretch in the back of the legs here. Now let's add the breath through the nose. Let's inhale. When you exhale, just relax into that stretch for the back of the legs. Again, inhale and exhale a little bit more to that stretch. One more time, inhale and exhaling a little bit more deeply into that stretch. Keep the back straight. Now when we inhale, slowly come on up. And exhale, relax, and take a moment to kick the legs out. Now let's do a U squat. So clasp the hands in front of your chest. So when we squat, we're going to twist to the right, we'll come up, and then we'll come down and twist to the left. So it's inhale and exhale, twist to the right, then inhale up to the left, we exhale, then inhale up, exhale to the right, inhale up, exhale to the left. Inhale up, exhale to the right. Inhale up, exhale makes three. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and four. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and five more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and six. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and three more. Inhale, 
exhale, inhale, and the last two, inhale, exhale, inhale, and one more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, no more. And inhale up and exhale, relax and kick the legs out. And uh, let's do a, a high knee with a twist. So put the palms in one on top of uh, the other in front of the chest, let the elbows up to shoulder height. So we're gonna bring our right knee up and twist to the right. Then we'll do the left side. So it's inhale and exhale, twist, then inhale down, other side. Exhale, then inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and three. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and four. Exhale, inhale, exhale, five more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and six. Exhale, inhale, exhale, and seven. Exhale, inhale, exhale, two more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, one more. Exhale, inhale, exhale, no more. Drop the arms down, shake it around. Now I want you to take into another stretch, a warrior pose. You probably need a chair by your side, some of you to help uh, base you. So you might want to just put it by your side and probably better to do it that way. So what I want you to do is step, uh, put both feet, the center line of your feet with the back leg of the chair. And then we're going to take a step back with our inside leg, lock the knees, shoulders are back and down. Now, if you widen the step, you have a better base of support. It'll be a little bit more challenging if you keep your feet narrow. So when you're looking at me like this, this is pretty challenging. But when I'm like this, I have a much better base of support. So it's up to you how much you want to put into this, okay? So make it work for you. So, shoulders are back down, palms from the abdomen, knees are locked. When you inhale, reach out to the side and exhale into a stretch. Then roll the palms up as you inhale, lift up through the abdomen. Now when you exhale, keep your arms over the head, but bend the front knee and stretch the back leg. Just hold it here for a moment. Now we're going to add the breath, three of them. So through the nose, let's inhale, lift up and stretch a little more. You can look up and then exhale. Again, inhale, feel the abdomen stretch, and then exhale, hold it right there. Again, inhale, just a little more. Now we exhale slowly. Come on down out of this. Step in with that leg. Take a moment to kick the legs out, shake the arms. Now let's do the other side. So feet in line with the back leg of the chair. Step back, that outside leg. Palms are probably out of it. Again, this is right here to hold on to if you need to. So inhale, reach out to the side, and exhale into a stretch. Then roll the palms up, you lift up, stretch through the abdomen, straighten the arms. Now when you exhale, bend the front knee and just lean into that stretch for the back of the leg. And just hold it right there. The body used to it. Now let's add the breath. So through the nose, then inhale, look up and stretch. And then exhale, hold it right there. Inhale, stretch just a little more and exhale, hold it. Inhale, just a tiny bit more and exhale slowly. Come on out of this. And then step in, shake the arms, kick the legs up, give the shoulders, and bobble the head. All right, now let's use a chair and do some heel lifts. Let's do, start off with both at the same time. So, stand with your uh, probably hands. Uh, you're probably gonna need the chair to hold on to, maybe you don't. I'm gonna do it without the chair. So, but if you need the, the chair's right here for you. So we, we're gonna bring both heels up, hold it for a count of 10, then bring it down, we'll do three sets. So it's in, and you can breathe naturally. So inhale up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. We'll do two more sets. So through the nose, inhale up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. And remember, you can breathe naturally while you're holding it up. So inhale up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. Now what we're gonna do, the chair's here for support, we're gonna bring our inside leg up and just lift the left heel up. All right, I need to hold on, you might probably do too. It's a little tougher. So we're gonna bring the, do it the same way, bring the uh, outside heel up, hold it for count of three, and then uh, for count of 10, and then bring it down, we'll do three sets. 
So through the nose, inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly come on down. Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly come on down. Now take a moment and kick the legs out a little bit. Just kind of loosen up. Take the arms. Now let's do it the other side. Bring the outside leg up this time. And here we go. Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. Two more times. Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. One more time. Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and slowly bring it down. Now we're going to use a kick the legs out for a second. Now we're going to use a chair. Sit down, and uh, but we're not going to get too comfortable yet. Do a couple more things for you, and um, I just see here. Okay, we're going to do a gluteal amnesia relief exercise. So put your hands on your knees and just going to lift the behind off the chair anywhere from three to six inches, just enough to get it up. And you're going to leave with the chin, pull it up with the chin. So you straight, keep the back nice and straight. So here we go. We're going to do a set of 10 of these. And inhale and inhale up one, two, three, and then slowly bring it down. Inhale up one, two, three, and slowly. That's number two. Inhale up one, two, three, and slowly bring it down. It's three. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. Bring it down. It's four. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. Now we have five more. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. Bring it down. Six. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. We have three more. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. <laughs> two more. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. You all look great. Inhale up, one, two, three, and exhale slowly. There will be no more on this. Now, we're going to tap the body down, and then we're going to a little relaxation quickly. So if you have glasses, you might want to remove them for a moment. And uh, we're going to start by tapping the top of our head, the flat bone, come to the crown, and just come down behind the head where the muscle connects the head bone there. Then come behind the ear, above the ear, all around the temples and temples. Now go up and down the ears with all your fingers, up and down the ears, just tapping. Then take your fingers and thumb and just squeeze a little bit up and down, just gently, just to kind of get flow of energy. Kind of want to make your ears a little bit red. And then uh, back to the temples, the temples, the temples. Now let's do all around the eye, uh, forehead, forehead, forehead. Now just come between the eyebrows above a little bit. This is your sixth chakra area in here. And let's do your eyebrows, around the eyebrows, outside corners of the eyes. Come down below the mind, uh, below the eyes, on top of the eye socket, straight down uh, on the upper level of the gum line. And then just come up to the back teeth and then come back down again. And now jump down to the lower level and do the same thing, coming up to the back teeth and then back down. And now just all around the chin, all around the chin. And then I'll come underneath the jaw. Start coming, tapping lightly underneath the jaw. So you tell you come behind the ears, uh, below the ears, behind the jawbone. There's some soft tissue in there. So it's a little sensitive. Now let's do scrunchy face and open face. Now, you can make a sound if you want. So uh, first, uh, but I want you to make it really tight and tighten up. We're going to do three of these. On the count of three, we'll do open face, and you can make a sound and stick your tongue out. Okay, one, two, three. Ah. Good for your face. Give it a good stretch. Now really tighten up, really tight. Tighten up the whole body, but really the face. One, two, three. Ah. One more time. Give it a good stretch. Oh, it's really tight. Okay. This last one, make a count. One, two, three. Ah. 
You relax and just feel the tingling in the face for a moment. Yeah, very refreshing. All right, now drop the head to the side, thumb up, and then take the flat of the hand, just tap high, hard where the neck touches the head, head area where it's attached. So you're tapping down into the lungs on top of the shoulder, top of the bicep, top of the forearm, start coming down the forearm to the wrist, top of the top, from the fist, lower wrist. And just start coming up the forearm to the elbow, tricep, tricep, armpit, armpit, upper part of the chest. Let's go to the other side, thumb up. Okay, top of the shoulder, top of the bicep, elbow, start coming down the forearm to the wrist, top of the palm, from the fist, lower wrist. Start coming up the forearm to the elbow, tricep, tricep, armpit, armpit. Okay, upper part of the chest, now follow me. When I go ha, you go ha. If I go ha ha, you go ha ha. It's a great way to relieve stress and it'll help you relax the body. So you really want to relax so it just becomes funny and you end up laughing, okay? Follow me, let me go first, ready? Ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! <laughs> oh boy, were you able to set yourself free and just laugh? It's such a wonderful feeling and it's so hilarious. <laughs> it's a good thing for us. Now come on down to the abdomen. Now, while you're tapping the abdomen, I want you to lean with your head, lift your chin up and lift your behind up. Now, take a step forward away from the chair and lean forward and do your kidneys, 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 buttocks, uh, tailbone, tailbone, tailbone. Buttocks, buttocks, buttocks. Come on down the back of the legs. Instep, instep, instep. Come up the inside. Hips, hips, hips. Come on down the outside. Come up the front of the legs. When you get to the knees, hang all around the knees. They start coming up with thighs. Abdomen, 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 abdomen. Drop the hands and your shoulders. Let's sweep down to the toes and just say it feels so good. A good positive affirmation. Ready? It feels so good. <laughs> yeah. Let's do that again. It feels so good. Third time is in Korean, which means it feels so good. It's I shawanada. Ready? I shawanada. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I invite you to sit down. Let's go into relaxation for a moment. And uh, just let the body absorb the energy that we just created from doing all that we did, which was a lot of work. And after our relaxation, we'll have the option to uh, use some weights here. Let the body rest for a second. Have a nice sip of water and just uh, bite your whistle, lower your eyes to the earth or close your eyes and just bring your mind's awareness to this very special moment, a moment in time where there is no time. And just allow yourself to completely and deeply relax as if you're melting, dissolving into the earth. You just feel the body. Every time you relax, you just allow yourself to relax a little bit more deeply and completely. Listen to the piano. Every time you exhale, relax your body. Next time you exhale, feel the face relax. Time you exhale, feel the shoulders relax. Let them go. On 
of the hardest things to do is to allow yourself to relax. Sometimes it just takes a little bit of practice. But what you're doing is allowing the body to absorb the energy. And when you relax, you release the tension. So you get a much better, freer flow of energy throughout your entire body. And you can begin to start feeling a tingling sensation as every cell is getting washed and rinsed, restoring you to your state of perfect health. And it's in this moment that you're absolutely perfect. You could not be more perfect than you are right now. You're okay just the way you are. There's nothing you have to do except enjoy being here now. This is your home. You can always come back here by just simply taking three big deep breaths and then just let everything about you become that breath. Just practice your breathing now so when you're just completely following the breath. You're aware of the body expanding when you inhale. When you exhale, you can feel the body deeply and completely relaxing. You just feel the piano. And I invite you to open your eyes. And let's clasp our hands in front of our abdomen. So when we inhale, bring the clasped hands up to our chest. Roll them forward as you exhale, extend the arms into a stretch. Then inhale and exhale a little more deeply into that stretch. Now when you inhale, lift the palms up. When we exhale, we've got the stretch. One more breath. Inhale, stretch out a little bit more. And then exhale. Wasn't that nice in the abdomen? It feels so good. Now you can either go like this or take your one hand on the opposite knee and Twist to the left first. So inhale and exhale into position. Take another breath. Inhale, twist a little more deeply and exhale. Come on back to the center. Now let's go the other way. So it's inhale and exhale. Look to the right. Then inhale and exhale a little bit more into that twist. Now when you inhale, come back to center and exhale, relax. Okay, we're done with the chair. I invite you to uh, stand up. Uh, Keep a sit, you may stay seated. Do the same things, uh, pretty much the same. You just won't get the leg workout if you don't stand up. So this first one that we're gonna do is be an overhead press and weights are optional. You don't have to use weights if you don't want to, okay? It's just, uh, sometimes it's a little bit better to stress your body and uh, just make it work for you. Now, um, you wanna put, uh, about 100% of your attention into the exercise, but 70% of your ability will work just fine. I'm gonna teach with weights. Now, your feet are about hip width apart. We're gonna start with bringing our weights up to our shoulders. So inhale up and exhale out to side and bend the knees. Now all we can do is press the weights, straighten the knees and press the weights over our head, or if you're just using fists, just touch them together. So it's inhale and exhale, push up, and inhale, come down. Exhale, push up, and inhale, that's two. Exhale, push up, and inhale, makes three. Exhale, push up, and inhale, four more. Exhale, push up, and inhale, that's five. Exhale, push up, and inhale, that's six. Exhale, push up, and inhale, one more. Exhale, push up, and inhale, no more. Then inhale, straighten the knees, and exhale, lower the arms, now take a moment, bend the elbows, and just kind of wiggle the shoulders, and then just kind of relax the arms, take the legs out. Now, let's do another overhead press, but this time we'll do a side step. So inhale up, exhale to the side. Now we'll do our right arm and tap to the right, and then come down to the left side. So we inhale and exhale, tap, stretch, then inhale to the left, Exhale, 
and inhale to the right. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Two. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Three. Going to eight. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Four more. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Last three. Exhale and inhale. Stretch and inhale. Two more. Exhale and inhale. Exhale, inhale one more. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale no more. Then inhale and exhale. Lower the arms down. Then bend the elbows and kind of move the shoulders around and just wiggle the arms, kind of loosen up, kick the legs out. Now let's do a bent over row. So we hinge at the hips a little bit, uh, uh, to take the lock out of the knees and then just hinge forward, let the arms drop. And all we're gonna do is pull our fists up to the shoulders. So we inhale and exhale, pull up, we're doing 10. Exhale, uh, inhale, come down. Exhale, pull up and inhale, that's two. Exhale, pull up and inhale three. Exhale, pull up and inhale four. Exhale, pull up and inhale five more. Exhale, pull up and inhale that six. Exhale, pull up and inhale last three. Exhale, pull up and inhale two more. Exhale, pull up and inhale no more. And inhale, straighten up and exhale, relax and kick the legs out. Now let's do a, uh, from here, Let's do a, a tricep kickback. So we want to uh, take the lock out of the knees, hinge at the hip, then inhale, bring the weights up to our chest, and then bring the elbows back as far as you can and hold it there. And from here, we kick back. So it's inhale and exhale, kick back and inhale. What a nice stretch. Exhale, stretch and inhale, that's two. Exhale, stretch and inhale, three. Exhale, stretch and inhale, four, going to 10. Exhale, stretch and inhale, five more. Exhale, stretch and inhale, six. Exhale, stretch and inhale, three more. Exhale, stretch and inhale, two more. Exhale, stretch and inhale, one more. Exhale, stretch and inhale, no more. Then inhale up and exhale, lower the arms down. Now let's just, if you're using weights, put them off to the side. Otherwise, start shaking your body, shaking the arms out, just kind of loosen up, shift the shoulders, bobble the heads, kind of uh, just wiggle things around a little bit. We're going to do three hard opening breaths, and then we're going to stretch the legs from the third one in a forward bend. So, palms in front of the abdomen, come down into a squat. Now, slowly come up so you stretch the uh, gluteals. So, inhale, come up. Get behind the stretch, and now you're stretching through the thighs, and then exhale, slowly come down. Two more. Through the nose, inhale, and stretch. Oh, that's so good. And exhale, let's do it one more time. Through the nose, inhale, and stretch it out. Now when we exhale, just hinge at the hips, let the arms hang, and feel that nice stretch, that pull on the back of the legs. Try to keep the back straight. Sometimes the best way to do that is just to lift your head up just a little bit or pull your shoulders back. Now let's add the breath through the nose. Let's inhale. When we exhale, just relax into that stretch for the back of the legs. Two more breaths. Inhaling and exhaling a little bit more deeply into that stretch. One more time. Inhale and exhaling even more deeply into that stretch. Now when we inhale very slowly, come on up, just feel it. Oh, it's such a good way to come up slow. And exhale, relax. <laughs> now kick the legs out, relax. Now let's, we'll do a hammer curl. So I try to announce this ahead of time a little bit so you can kind of know what weights you want to do. Some of you like to switch your weights out. And uh, this is a hammer curl. The knees are soft and shoulders are back and down. All we're gonna do is bring our fists to the shoulders. We're not twisting the wrists or anything. So it's inhale and exhale, come up and inhale, slowly come down. Exhale, come up and inhale, that's two. We're going to 10, exhale and inhale makes three. Exhale and inhale, four. Exhale and inhale, five more. Exhale and inhale, that's six. 
exhale and inhale last three exhale and inhale two more exhale and inhale one more exhale and inhale no more and inhale just straighten the knees a little bit exhale relaxes uh, bend the elbow, elbows and kind of wiggle the shoulders shake the arms kind of wiggle it out all right now <laughs> That's this next one, let's do an overhead tricep extension. I, if I'm using weights, I usually like to put both weights together. You may want to reduce the weight for you or no weight at all. If you're not using weight, just clasp your hands in front of you. The knees are soft. Let's inhale up and then exhale into position. Just drop behind the head. All we can do is extend the arms and straighten the knees. So we begin with an inhale. Now exhale, push up and stretch through the abdomen and then inhale, come down. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, that's two. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, make three. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, four. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, five more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, six. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, three more. Exhale, stretch, and inhale, last two. Exhale, stretch, Stretch and inhale one more. Exhale, stretch and inhale no more. And inhale up and exhale, slowly bring them down. And then just kind of shake the arms, shoot the shoulders, kind of bend the elbows, shoot the shoulders, and then wiggle the arms, kick the legs out. Now let's do one more. One more with weights. And then we're going to stretch the body out. So we're going to bring a, it's going to be a march with the bicep curl. We're gonna bring our right arm up and left knee up at the same time. So if you need to lean into a wall or a chair to do this, to keep your balance, you can do that. Otherwise, give it a shot. This is great for your balance. So we begin with an inhale and exhale, pull up and inhale down, left side. Exhale and inhale, that's one. Exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale two, exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale three, exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale, that's four, exhale and inhale, exhale and inhale five more, exhale and inhale, Exhale and inhale six. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale three more. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale last two. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale one more. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale no more. Then inhale and exhale, relax. Now kind of wiggle it up. Let's put the weights down off to the side. We're done with weight. Shake it up a little bit and then shin the shoulders. Let's do three hard opening breaths and then we'll go into a series of stretches. Palms in front of the abdomen and inhale. Give a nice big stretch through the thighs and exhale. Let's do two more. Inhale and just stretch and exhale. Now, if you bend the knees a little bit, you'll come up and you'll feel the buttocks when you stretch. But inhale, stretching through the buttocks, the thighs, and the abdomen, and exhale. Let's hinge at a forward bend. And just let the arms hang, head up. Feel the nice pull in the back of the legs. And now when you inhale, you feel the body expand, but when you exhale, you just relax a little more deeply for that stretch in the back of the legs. Two more breaths, inhaling. And exhaling just a little bit more deeply into that stretch. One more time. Inhale. Oh, that feels so good. And exhale. Relax into that stretch. Now, when we inhale, slowly come up. And exhale, relax and kick the legs out. Now, let's work on the legs a little bit more. So, hands and the hips. We're going to uh, stretch the back of the legs in a dynamic stretch. So, we're going to pack the uh, left and the right hip as we go down and around. So inhale up, lock the knees. When you exhale, just hinge at the hip, come down your right side. 
and then bring the torso across the semi center line of the body, stretching through the back of the legs. Now when you inhale up, you feel it in your right hip. And when you exhale down, you feel it in your left hip. Now feel the back of the legs as you move the body across. And inhale up, feel it in your right hip. Exhale down, you feel it in your left hip. Stretching through the back of the legs. Now inhale up. When you get to the top, we're going to reverse. Now exhale down the opposite way. You feel it in your right hip, stretching through the back of the legs. Feel it in your left hip as you inhale up. And exhale down, stretching through the back of the legs. And inhale up. One more time around as we exhale on the down stroke. Stretching through the back of the legs and slowly inhale up. And take a moment and exhale and kick the legs up. Now, step forward to your right foot. Let's just do one leg stretch at a time. Now, put your hands on your hips, lock that front knee. So when you inhale up, you exhale, lower yourself down, just hinge at the hip, and so you don't come down any further, and then hold it right there. And just let your body get used to the challenge for the balance and just start enjoying that stretch in the back of the leg. Now we're gonna add the breath through the nose. Let's inhale. When we exhale, just relax into that stretch for the back of the leg. Two more breaths, inhaling, and exhaling a little bit more into that stretch. One more time, inhale, and exhaling even more deeply into that stretch. Now, when we inhale, slowly come on up, and exhale, relax, take the legs and kick them out, shake them out. Now let's do the other side. Step forward with your left leg. Hands in the hips. Let's inhale up and exhale. Come on down. What a nice stretch this is for the back of the leg. Let it hold it there for a moment. Find your balance. Let's add the breath through the nose. Big inhale. And exhale. Just relax a little bit more into that stretch. Again, inhale. And exhale. Bring your mind right into that stretch. Oh, it feels so good. Again, through the nose. Inhale. And exhaling a little bit more deeply into that stretch. Now, when we inhale, slowly come up. We exhale, relax, and kick the legs out a little bit. Now, I invite you to join me, sit down, and let me see if you have a question or two that I.